You walk into a side room, you were seated at a comfortable wooden table, opponent goes, hey, is there anything you uh, you want here? I didn't, you know, I didn't eat, drink, drink coffee, you want something else? I'll just take a, I'll take a glass of water, glass a little of water. lime. Um, she walks out to go get a glass of water for you. She walks back in with the glass of water, and right behind her is Liz. Oh, come on. Uh, Liz Herrera walks in. She clearly knows who she's going in to talk to, so she has her game face on. She sits down, looks at you. Mr. Brown, thank you for coming in today. My you name is Liz. Call me Liz. You gonna call me Mr. Brown? Okay. <laughs> okay. Are we gonna do this? No, we're not gonna do it. Yeah, no. <laughs> Are we gonna do this? No, Mr. Brown's ready to talk. I'm at work. <laughs> so the thing with me here, Kingston, is that I'm at work right now. Okay, but. Okay. I'm See, Epona puts the water down and says, I'm gonna fully go. I'm gonna go. <laughs> uh, she steps out. Uh, you see that Liz turns a recorder on and keeps her voice professional, but is just fucking staring daggers at you. So, Kingston, it's, it's my understanding that you attended the wedding of Angela Confetti to Ronald Pigeon. Yes, I was on a date with Misty Moore to the confetti wedding on Sunday. Click. Fuck you. No, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck yourself. All right, you know what? I don't want to do this. I you always know knew there was something I, weird with her, you and her. She's wanted to fuck you for years. Yeah. I know it. <laughs> You're such a piece I of shit. I never fucked you her. You are I such never, a fucking don't dog. Don't even do this. You know? You're telling me you were faithful voice to the city. I am faithful. I was faithful. I would have continued to be faithful. It wasn't a date. I just... I'm... I'm mad, okay? <laughs> It was, uh, we just, we were going there because there was some stuff going, there's been some stuff going on with the whole Santa Claus thing, and yeah, it was business. I don't know why I said it was a day. Business. So what, so the, the mummy's back or something? No, the mummy's not back. It's, something's going on with Nod. <sighs> Nod, refresh my memory, that is? It's the Sixth Borough, it's the dreamland. It's, I don't know, there's this new kid on the block named Pete, who I guess is the Vox Phantasma. He's me, but for them, I, I, anyway. She clicks the thing back on. <sighs> so, Mr. Brown, you were attending at the wedding. Did you hear anything amounting to criminal conspiracy having to do with the assault on Santa Claus in Central Park? Uh, according to Don Confetti, the two, two pixies had gone downtown and confessed to being the ones who, you know, had hijacked or, you know, uh, vandalized the sled. And the names of these individuals are? Uh, Pixie and Trixie or something like that. I don't mean to be rude. No, they, their names are stupid. It's <laughs> Twinkle and Pinky. There it is, Twinkle and Pinky. That's what I heard. Click. And because I have to fucking work in okay. this department, now, mm -hmm. I have to prosecute Twinkle and Pinky. I still law. These are still people. It is. A, I live in a fucking cartoon now. You don't live. This is not a cartoon. Because of you, I live in a fucking cartoon. This is New York City. This is the real thing. Oh, oh, oh a horsewoman just brought you a cup of water, and these two pixies I got to put away for attacking She's a Santa goddamn Santa. centaur. I go through, I would say, half a bottle of whiskey every night just to get to that the fucking That is so day. bad for you. You have <laughs> to come see me. And oh, I... what, so you can do your magic hands? I want to fight with you. I was on track to be the, the district attorney. I was on track to be somebody. And now I'm here. I had to watch them fingerprint a pile of shit. <laughs> today. Oh. Do you know how unpleasant that is to watch? I can only imagine. I, Liz, what do you want me to say, all right? I'm, so, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I fell in love with you. I'm sorry you fell in love with me. I'm sorry we were married. I'm sorry it didn't work out. I'm sorry I brought you <laughs> into all of this. What do you want me to say? And please don't call me Mr. Brown. Click. Mr. Brown, thank you very much for your time. Oh. Great, I'll see you later. Call me if you need anything, and tell that pile of shit I'll get cut grass down here. <laughs>
<laughs> our lives suck so bad. Oh my god. You can't do a campaign about New York City and have people's lives not be truly fucking miserable. Uh, incredible. Greatest city in the world! 